Well, today on Gearbox, we're looking at the Cal32 column array loudspeaker from Maya Sound. Yeah, now the 32, so-called, because there are 32 transducers, 32 amplifier channels, and 32 channels of DSP. Uh, you can also get bigger models, the 64 and the 96. The uh, same logic applies. Yeah, and basically what you, what you achieve by going to the bigger models is that you can throw the same SPL over a further distance. So this guy will do 106 dB at 30 meters. The 64 will do the same SPL at 60 meters and the 96 again winds that distance out to 90 mm, meters. Mm, yeah. Now, we should mention, uh, this is not the standard installation method. Ordinarily, you'd have it standing upright. Mm. We just can't fit it upright <laughs> in the shot. And ordinarily, you'd also have the grill on the front. And you can get this thing in any color you want. Mm, mm. And it's IP rated. You can actually put it outside, yeah, out of the box. Yeah, straight out of its shipping carton. You mm. can unpack it and screw it to a wall outdoors. Mm make your connections and then put a little cover plate on the back panel yeah. and uh, yeah and the connectivity will shine yeah. yeah the connectivity is one of the things I really like about it so on the back you've got um, Phoenix connectors for analog input you've got uh, GPIO um, for you know contact closures stuff like that and you've got AVB so really you, you just need to get power to this thing and a cat 5 yeah and this is actually the first AVNU certified it speaker is. I believe mm. um, now one thing we haven't actually talked about yet is the pattern, yeah, the, beam the coverage, yeah. um, and that's because it can be varied. Uh, essentially, you can have your vertical coverage anything from five through to thirty degrees mm -hmm. in five degree increments, yep. and then you can step that beam, mm. such as it is, up or down by thirty degrees in mm. one degree increments. Yeah, um, and you can set up four different presets within Compass, which mm -hmm. is the software you use to control it, mm. and that can actually be run on the same connection as your AVB. Yeah, one, yeah. one cable. Yeah, very very convenient. Um, yeah, and so you can set up four different presets and then just switch between them. It takes about a couple of minutes to to actually build the presets and then upload them into the cow. But once they're there, you can switch between those four and it's very quick. It's yeah, less than a second. So this is absolutely perfect for really difficult acoustics like cathedrals, stadia, airports, anywhere where you need a lot of intelligibility and you've got some interesting reverberant, uh, you know, anywhere you to want to be able to point the speaker at a surface but not the sound that comes out of it. Yeah, yeah. So look. It's obviously a very difficult job to get right, but I think Maya have really done a great job in making it as easy as possible. Yeah, look, um, operating range, obviously, you know, it is a column speaker. The biggest driver in this is, what, four inches. Mm. So you're never going to get huge amounts of low frequency out of it. It's not really about... It's not what it's for. Uh, mm. No, it's not It's not like a rock PA. It's, mm. it's a, a very, very high intelligibility uh, speech system, and I, th I think it does exactly that, and it does it wonderfully well. Yep.